In this video, we will learn how to create a sales order, knowing that we can create sales invoice directly without passing through the sales order. We can directly create a sales order and import data from multi-sales order to generate a sales invoice. We will go now through the different steps. First step, we go to sales order. In sales order form, we will get the list of orders already created. To create a new sales order, we click new. We choose the branch. Undefined auxiliary is not mandatory, so we skip it. Reference and date of the order. We search for the client, account number, currency, rate, cost center if we have a cost center. We enter the value date. The accounting description and the region will be filled automatically from the customer file. We enter the salesman of the order. In the details section, we choose the item, the filtered criteria will be displayed and we choose the corresponding unit. We choose the warehouse. We enter the quantity. And since no price list is defined for this item and I want to know the cost of this product, I double click on the item. A new window will open, which has all the item's information. LPP is the last purchase price, the APP is the average purchase price, and the FOB price is the free onboard price. Now I decide what price to sell, I edit the price, and click on the down arrow to enter another item. I double click on the item to get the item information. A new window will open, which has all the item's information. I enter the quantity and the price to finish the order. After finishing the sales order, I click Save. We can create more than one sales order and we can copy the sales order or delete it. Once the order is saved, I can convert it to sales invoice by clicking on Post Order to Invoice. We can create more than one sales order and we can copy the sales order or delete it. Thank you.